Alright, before we begin, I would just like to say I finally got rid of that annoying light on the screen. So, yeah. Do you thought the battle that also takes place in the cleaning place thing? Enter a fossil battle? Yes. Captain Travelers. Haha, <laughs> we meet again, Fuzzy. Do you remember me? I'm the captain of the fine vessel that brought you to this island. I guess it's time for your first fossil battle, and I don't expect to lose, Fuzzy. You should expect differently. Oh yeah, one more thing I should let you know. There's a formation screen before battle, but it doesn't matter now since this is a one-on-one -on -one battle. Press the ready button in the lower right of the formation screen to advance on to the next screen. Alrighty then, it's time for battle. I hope you've got some moves for me. I will be showing the top screen during battle. Eight damage. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I kind of have to laugh. I mean, he died in one turn. <laughs> Captain Travelers. Well, how about that, Fuzzy? I guess that makes you an official fossil fighter. Now I've got some advice for you. If you lose fossil battle, you'll most likely be returned to your hotel. But try to save it as often as you as possible, you hear? No sense taking risks at your age. Alright, here's a little something for you. It's a fossil of the Vivasaur you said you like. For winning, you receive a Tarbo, which is what I accidentally picked. From Captain Travelers. Tarbo legs, sorry. But that fossil rock I just gave you isn't a head fossil, so you can't revive it right away. The head is somewhere out there for you to find, Fuzzy. I'm wishing you the best, Fuzzy. Good luck. Congratulations, Fuzzy. You passed your fighter's test. I can now present you with your fighter's license. Fighters, this is Fuzzy Level 1 Fighter. <clears throat> you got a fighter's license. This is proof that you are now a recognized fossil fighter. Congratulations, Fuzzy. That makes you a level 1 fighter. You now have access to some new features on the status menu. Yikes, where'd the time go? You must be tired anyway, Fuzzy. Sorry for all the yapping again. Your life as a licensed fighter begins with a bang tomorrow. Get yourself a good night's rest. Best of luck on your road to becoming a master fighter, Fuzzy. <laughs> Save your progress. I will select yes. Mm -hmm. Chapter 1, The Missing Metals. You can now open the status menu. Dr. Diggins, hello, anyone home? Fuzzy? I forgot a few things. I do that sometimes. Mm -hmm. This is your fighter's journal. You got a fighter's journal. That fighter journal is really useful. It'll tell you what you're supposed to do next. Also, here's a sonar system for finding fossils and a pickaxe for digging them up. You got a sonar and a pickaxe. The sonar device detects objects buried underground, including fossil rocks. You should get some practice first, so I, rec so I recommend you go try it out at the trial dig site. Talk to B again. Go talk to B again in the park area. She'll show you the ropes. Mm -hmm. 
Anyway, I've got to get back to the fossil center. Stop by if you have any questions. You know, if I had a question, how would I ask it to you? Hotel manager. Greetings, Fuzzy. Greetings? Why not hello? Congratulations on acquiring your fighter's license so quickly. Please allow me to, br to explain briefly about the status menu. The status menu refers to the screen you use to use your status. To open the status menu, press the X button or tap the orange icon in the lower right corner of the screen. The status menu provides information on your level, money, and FP along with your case con contact and items. You can use the that you can also see the dino medals that you're currently carrying. Another feature is your fighter's journal displayed in your important items list. The fighter's journal suggests what you might try next. It's quite useful when you're stuck. You can also view your dino medals by checking the dino medal screen. To open the dino medal screen, press the Y button or tap the green icon in the lower left corner. Would you like to hear my explanation again? No. Thank you for your time. I'll let you be on your way now. Beginner. So you're the new fighter, huh? My name is Beginner. No jokes, please. I teach all the rookies who come here the basics of digging up fossils. Shall we go to the trial dig site and get some hands-on experience? Great, let's go. Now we're about to go. Alright, let me show you how to use your sonar. Look at the sonar readout on the top screen. The yellow arrow in the middle shows your location. Press the L or R button to activate the sonar and display the dot where something is buried. That could just that could be a fossil rock or it's normal rock. You don't won't know until you dig it up. If you go to a spot marked marked with a dot and press the A button to swing your pickaxe, you can dig it up. When doing so, be careful not to stand directly on top of the location indicated by the dot. Stop in front of the dot and then press the A button. Now let's practice. I'll bear us three rocks and I want you to find them and dig them up. It doesn't matter which one you pick first, it'll always be in the same order. Okay, use your sonar to find the three rocks that I buried. I'll even let you keep any fossil rocks you dig up. Alright, um, I'm going to end right now, so, yeah. Bye.